guys welcome and today I'm going to share with you how I flat iron my hair and also the steps that I did to prep my hair to prepare for the straightening and also dusting of my ends so if you want to see how I do that then just keep watching so I prep my hair by shampooing and clarifying my hair with the Trader Joe's tea tree tingle shampoo I then deep condition my hair using Shea Moisture Intense Hydration Mask along with my hot head heat cap by Thermal Hair Care. I then detangled my hair using Not Your Mother's Kinky Moves. Uh, this product was very lightweight and was great as a detangler. For, for my leave-in, I used the Affigy Keratin and Green Tea Restructurizer. Uh, this product is great because it utilizes levels of protein for strength, emollients for shine, and humectants for softening. And for my heat protectant, I use the John Frieda Free Ease Original 6 FX Serum. This product eliminates frizz, humidity protection, heat protection, smooths, hydrates, and tames. And per instructions, you are to put this on your hair when it's soaking wet. So that is what I did. And I sectioned my hair off into a total of six twists, which I stretched across my head and allowed to air dry overnight. Okay, so this is the last twist of the six that I did. I'm just going to undo my hair and lightly finger detangle and also make sure to check for any dampness. So here I'm going to use my handleless blow dryer on the cool setting to further stretch out my hair. I'm just going to take a small section of hair and by using a smaller section it also ensures that I only use one pass when flat ironing my hair. And here I'm just taking just a smidget of the John Frieda Heat Protective Serum and putting it on my hair. But it's very small amount. Okay, what that is there is a straightening comb, but it's not hot. So if you're familiar with the chase method, this is what this comb does. It is heat resistant as well as anti-static. I struggle using a regular comb, but this is perfect. And there I'm just giving my hair a light trim. I'm doing it at an angle. So when it's straight, it lays its layers and not a blunt cut. So I'm not gonna cut it straight across the bottom. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more hair care tutorials and also product reviews, then consider subscribing. Until then, I will see you in the next video. Bye.